Hello everybody, uh, my name is Tal and what we're going to do right now is fool around with some Spider-Man physics. So to edit the project, let's go to a very cool website called glitch.com. Uh, go there and search for the project that I put up there. Uh, the project name is spider-physics. Spider-physics. Click on it and click on view source and this will show you the source code of the project. You can see the various files here. Um, so the first thing we want to do is we want to make our own version because you can't edit this version. Uh, so to edit your own version, click on Remix to edit. This will give you a new name and a new project which is a copy of the original. You can rename it. So let's rename this project to My Spider. Um, very cool. You can see the various source files for the project here. Um, so before we start touching anything, let's just see if it works. So click on show in a new window. And as you can see, it is working. And you get a URL for it. Um, myspider.glitch.me. So let's go and open it up on, this, uh, on the Octolus Quest inside the browser uh, just to see the original game. Okay, so right now we're inside the Oculus Quest. Uh, let's go to the browser. In the browser, let's type down the URL that we just had. Spider.glitch.me. Okay, it's loading up. As you can see, it's working. Click on VR to go into VR. And as we can see, the game is working. Okay, um, now let's make a change. Uh, we saw that it's working. Um, so there are two interesting files here, the player file and the web shooter file. Uh, the player file has various physics uh, properties of the player of Spider-Man itself uh, and the web.js file has various physical properties of the web shooters. Um, so let's start by changing some of the parameters of the player. First thing we're going to do, we're going to take a look at the gravity. Um, we're going to change it to the gravity to be much higher. So let's change it from negative 9.8 to be negative 12. And let's make Spider-Man bouncy. So you see right now the bounce factor is 0 0.1. Let's change it to 0 0.95. Um, so that's it. We don't even need to save. All we have to do now is reload it on the Oculus Quest to see what it feels like. Okay, uh, so now we're back. Um, and the main thing we need to do is reload to refresh the page to see our changes. So let's click reload, wait until it finishes reloading. Okay, done. And let's go back into VR and see our bouncing Spider-Man. Okay, let's hit the wall. Whoa, now we're bouncing all around. <laughs> kind of like a basketball. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> this is pretty cool. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, that was pretty cool. So let's change it back uh, just so we can see something else. So I'm putting the bouncing this back to what it was and I'm changing the gravity back to 9.8. Uh, now let's fool around with a little bit of uh, with the web. Uh, the webs that we're shooting. Uh, so the thing I want to do is I want to increase their strength significantly. So they're going to pull me much, much, uh, they're going to be much stronger. So let's change it from 100 to 350. Um, let's see what it looks like. Okay, so we're back there bouncing all around. Now let's refresh the browser to see the changes uh, that we just made. Um, we refreshed, let's go into VR mode and let's shoot. Okay, this should be very, very strong. Whoa! <laughs> oh my god, that was so strong. We're up in the clouds. 
Wait, let's wait until we... Oh my god. That was a bit too strong. Let's wait until we drop back down. Oh my god. <laughs> Whoa! Okay, we need to tone it down because this is just simply uh, <laughs> a bit too powerful. Where am I? Where am I? Okay, we're dropping down. Whoa. <laughs> that was amazing. Okay, that's it. Uh, so you can fool around with both of these files. Uh, you can see here documentation of all the different fields and what they do uh, in player and in the web. Uh, so feel free and have fun. Bye-bye. <laughs>